ever had a dream that was so real you couldn't remember if it actually happened? Or a crazy uncle that imagined stuff that definitely never took place? Well, might be time to get a brain scan. The part of your brain that helps you tell the difference between something real and something imagined is called the parasingulate sulcus. But around one quarter of people don't have a parasingulate sulcus and can sometimes have trouble telling the difference between something real and something imagined. For example, telling the difference between the real world and virtual reality. Virtual reality technology is a huge challenge for our brains because it gives first person sounds and images that are getting so realistic it can be difficult for our brains to tell them from the real thing, particularly for people that don't have a parasingulate sulcus. Now this can actually be a good thing. First person virtual reality games have been shown to help people with autism develop empathy because it puts them in someone else's shoes without them having to imagine. In the future, it might even be possible to use virtual reality technology to implant experiences, kind of like what happens to Arnie in the film Total Recall, or Colin Farrell if you're watching the modern version. But for now, virtual reality is mostly used for some really cool games. Hi everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching SciQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.